Hey everyone, it's Mrs. Sabinas, your favorite teacher, and I'm glad you've missed me so much. I know you've missed me so much because I've missed you too. Anyway, I'm actually here for a purpose. I have had some messages and comments that you've been having some trouble with um, highlighting like you were supposed to do in assignment one. So I'm going to make a quick video. Let me share my screen. One second, it takes me a second. There it is. Okay, sorry about the wait. All right, here is the assignment. I made my husband be a student, as you can see, Josh Sabinas, so I can show you how to highlight. Okay, so number one, let's just do that one right now. I'm going to click, or you should click, and drag across the correct answer, which for number one would be who enjoys searching for treasure. And then once I've clicked and dragged, don't click on anything else. Go up to this marker right here, where, and if you hover over it, it should say highlight color. Click on that, and then you can pick any color you want. So I'm gonna go with the basic yellow. And then you would do the same thing for all of them. So for number two, the correct answer would be that he uses most. And then again, oops, I forgot the T. Let me do it again. Then I'd click up to the marker, and then please pick the same color. I've had some students who've been picking every color in the rainbow and guys that is it's a lot um to process and because when i go through and try to correct some of your answers i use a different color so if you could just stick to one color it can be any one color but just please choose one and that's how you do it and then in the bottom section because the top as it says you're supposed to be highlighting the clause that modifies it which means you should be having a whole group of words and just some assignment help really quickly with numbers one through ten um we have done subordinate um, clauses before and if you've noticed a lot of these start with that so even your examples it says whom or when this one has who or that so these are starting with subordinate conjunctions it would be a subordinate clause so make sure that you're thinking about that as you're choosing your answers okay so highlighting for just one word now of course you can click and drag the correct answer for 11 is choose or chose I guess um, you can click and drag but if you're just doing one word is actually a lot easier to double click so I one, two, and then it um, highlights the whole word for me. And then again, just as for one and two, we did a, a, at the above portion, you'd click the marker, click the color, and then that would be your answer. So um, make sure that's how you do it for one word. I mean, again, you can click and drag if you want, but if you double click, it's a little bit easier. Um, some assignment help for the bottom section, you were supposed to just click one word, so be sure you do that. Um, for instance, number 12, the answer should be coat. And I have students who, are hiding the coat, um, so make sure it's just the one word. Also, as you can see in number 11, um, it's actually modifying the word chose, which is a verb, and then in number 12, it's modifying the word coat, which is a noun. So usually, if you're going to have words such as that or who, it's going to be a noun that you're going to choose as your answer. If it's not, then you should probably choose the verb in the sentence. So. Um, okay, I'm going to unshare my screen. If you have any other problems or questions or concerns, um, message me or just leave a comment on the assignment and I'll be happy to help. And then I did post um, below in Google Classroom that if you'd like to do one of these Hangouts, I can actually make one of these videos where all of us can be on at once, which sounds a little crazy, but we could probably use a little crazy right now since it's kind of boring. So um, if you are someone who would like to do um, a Google Hangout, and it's not really a Google Hangout, this is actually this is actually called Zoom, and I would send a link to you, and you just log on through Google. It's super simple. So, all right. Um, if you're interested in that, go down to the post below, and then say, yes, Mrs. Sabinas, I would love that because I miss you so much. Okay? All right. Bye, guys.